Hey, what's going on, you guys? Like what you got to the channel? It's your boy Big Dog back with another. Well, I'm about to say trailer reaction. Technically, it is a trailer reaction, but it's an honest trailer for Joker. I watch honest trailers a lot, but I don't usually react to them like I used to. Because someone I would react to them and I'd just be like, you yeah, know, just I'm just sitting here. So I don't even know if this is gonna go up on YouTube. I just this is the first one I've recorded, the first reaction for honest trailer I've recorded in quite some time. But uh Let's see what it's hidden for. Let go. From the studio who won't release the Snyder Cut. <laughs> I'm sorry. You have the most beautiful feet. Comes a period of what? about psychological and social decay with the bare minimum of Batman it took to get the movie made. <laughs> <laughs> Book with the pearls and everything. Happy. <laughs> Prepare for a film the media said was too dangerous for you to see, which made audiences way more excited than regular marketing ever could have. Yep. Losing its way to a billion dollars on a 55 billion budget because it got hyped like a cinematic fear toxin that would turn you into the Joker, even though it ended up being a mumble course Corsese riff about the world's saddest clown. <laughs> I've been watching Iron Man for 12 years and I'm still a moron. <laughs> Journey to 1980s Gotham, where the garbage is high, the clown rental business is booming, and everything is yellow. From this urban squalor, a Joker will rise in Arthur Flack. And if Marvel is known for making their heroes get ribbed, DC will one up them by making their star get ribs. <laughs> it's a loner who deserves all your sympathy for being poor and all yep. of your contempt for being a viral video star and wannabe comedian. Um, uh, he's got the faded hoodie and everything. Dude looks like he's about to ask you to do his podcast. <laughs> Go back to the other mic, you piece of <laughs> uh! <laughs> Some jokers are in it for the ego. Some just want to watch the world burn. Now, this version is here to teach you a lesson. You should show more compassion for the mentally ill, or they'll snap and kill you. <laughs> <laughs> This Joker has a few unique tricks up his sleeve, like the superhuman capacity to, um, bathe the elderly, sleep in a refrigerator, yeah, I, I don't know why he did, but... and instead of writing damaged on his forehead, just damage his forehead. Yikes. You better fight Batman quick before he turns 12 and overpowers him. Watch that sweet kid. <laughs> Experience a film with one of the all-time great Joaquin Phoenix gangly loner performances and one of the, let's say, third most uncomfortable Joaquin Phoenix interviews. We're having fun. Is that? That's We're fun? We're having fun. Just uh, relax. Okay. Seriously. Do I have a large frog in my hair? No. No. Something's crawling out of my scalp. That shows off one of the greatest actors of our generations. The one with Jimmy Kimmel was pretty bad too. <laughs> to laughing because of a medical condition. <laughs> to laughing maniacally. Yeah, he got his ass with a lot. Do you feel some type of way about society? This movie does. And the message is going to be in close up and bold just in case you missed it. <laughs> because the true villains of Joker are uncaring billionaires, misogynist Wall Street jerks. I ignore him. He's being nice to you. 
lack of government funding. The city's cut funding across the board. Social services is part of that. And easy access to guns. You gotta protect yourself out there. Who's so the wait, it wasn't an Enzo rallying cry or an anti-SJW screed. How is it possible that every hot take about this movie was wrong, including the directors? So enjoy a Joker movie that's such a thoughtful, challenging comic book movie. It almost qualifies as a movie movie with a take on the iconic character that perfectly fits our current day and age. Yeah. That isn't fun like the 60s, innocent like the 80s, grim like the 2000s, or embarrassing like the 2010s. Come on, man. This is a story Get my butt, Jared Little. Great, bruh. That immediately forget until the next outrage comes along. Everybody just yells and screams at each other. I'm so sick of this society. It makes me so mad I'm gonna lose it and do Joker stuff. Mom, get in the bag. Starring Mober. They're all gonna laugh at you. Don't trust that Z in a part <laughs> AB because she's imaginary. You are not the father. Lil Wayne, don't you go round and round to re-row. That was great. That was great. Hey, Arthur, are we cool? And stay. What is this from? What is this? This this uh, the music from? Can I think of? Dance Dance Revolution. <laughs> These finance guys know all the words to send in the clowns. A lot of late night Sondheim sessions with the boys. When you give me my Oscar. Can you introduce me as Joker? Yes! Ah, that was great! That was great. Jack Skellington eating Jello would technically be cannibalism. That was great. This ish just got real. Juicy Petunia. I'm, uh... That was good. That was good. Not gonna... Everything I said was pretty true. And accurate. Uh yeah, this is I think okay, yeah, I'm definitely uploading this one. Uh big fan of Honest Trailer, big fan of Screen Junkies, uh not that fan of entertainment now, but uh I enjoyed that. Gotta be keeping a book which um What was the one? Uh when you uh, give him the Oscar introduce me to I think I think we all can agree. I think he's taking it home. Okay. I, I, I definitely think he's taking it home. Uh, Joker was my second favorite movie of last year. If you don't know what beat it, go check out my top 10 movies of, of last, uh, 20, I mean, 2019. Uh, yeah, I, I absolutely love that film. I think, and I think it's pretty accurate. The the scene that still gets me to this day, and I think I clipped it out and just got it on my phone with the scene where it's just like, nobody's civilized anymore. Everybody just yelling, you know, so I was just like, yeah, that's pretty much what the internet is. <laughs> so I really enjoy I enjoyed this on this trailer, man. You guys uh, let me know what you thought about it down in the comments. Hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.